First, we're going to get a pot of water boiling for macaroni, adding in some salt to help it to boil. We're going to add some olive oil in the water. This will actually help the macaroni from not sticking together after you rinse it and drain it. And we're actually now going to let the water boil up before we insert the macaroni. And now we are adding the macaroni. We're going to just stir this around a little bit so it won't stick. And we're going to let this boil for about 7 minutes so it's al dente. Just done enough. While our macaroni is cooking, we're going to go over and prepare the other ingredients for our soup. Starting by first, by mincing up our garlic. Using a hammer and a knife, we're going to crack the shell of the garlic to help separate the skin from the meat. Now using my favorite um, chopper that avoids the tears, I'm going, we're going to chop up the onion or mince up the onion as well. Next we're going to core a tomato and cut it into wedges. Our ingredients are now ready to be added to our soup. Our macaroni has nicely boiled on up to just in time. And we are now going to rinse it, drain it, and rinse it. Yeah. Putting aside the macaroni, we're going to bring back the pan and cook up the garlic in a little olive oil. First, just fry this up to release the aromas of the garlic. Next, we are going to fry up our onions and to caramelize our onions here. Again, adding a little more olive oil and we want a nice caramel brown color for our, for our onions. Next, we're adding um, our water, adding some additional water to the soup and stirring it up. And we're adding our wedged tomatoes. Let that cook up. And now we are adding our can of chili with beans into our soup. And that will also cook up too. Using the can of chili, we don't have to add additional seasoning because the chili will provide the additional flavorings for our soup. And then we return our rinsed macaroni back into the soup. And we're going to stir that up. And we're going to bring it to a boil. And try to reduce some of the liquid down. Letting the soup come up to a very rapid boil. The purpose here is we want to basically reduce the liquid down to a little bit less. So it'll be a little less soupy and more hearty. So a nice hearty chili macaroni veggie soup. Now our soup is boiling nicely too. The soup is boiling very nicely. It should be just a matter of minutes for the liquid to be reduced down to a nice hearty flavorable type of soup. This. So it's very good. So we'll be eating soon. Again, constantly stirring the soup so it won't, nothing will stick. 
and you want to stick it to the bottom of the pan and just stirring and mixing it all everything together. Our soup is now ready. Using a ladle, we're going to dish up a soup, getting that hearty chili, macaroni, veggies, tomatoes. And you can always top it with a little bit of grated cheese. With a little bit of grated cheese.